Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of a new series, which is probably not another episode, but yeah, sure, whatever. Anyways, guys, welcome to dun 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 diversity. Yeah. So guys, um, with the whole release of the whole new sequel of this map, and being considering that this map has been ar around been around for a while, and I always wanted to play this map, and you know, along with the events and everything, I want to play this map. And I thought, why not record it? And here we are. So yeah, so let's go here now. Which one should I read? Reading for jumps, even though I, I don't mind reading, but yeah. This is diversity. Complete the branches to collect the wool. Warning, traveling to and from hubs will clear your inventory. Multiplayer, don't really care. Rules, no breaking or placing items unless instructed or implied. Number two, no changing difficulty or game mode. Three, no typing game commands. 4. Single player. Select easy now and avoid option screen. See recommended guide for details. Highly recommended. Brightness full. Resource pack default. Clouds off. Render distance far. Now, this this one. It can't really do that. My computer sucks. It can't do that or else I'm just going to lag like madman. So it can't really do that. So anyways, yeah. Begin. Head and go for the introductory wool. So yeah. Anyways, I actually saw a few videos about this, but I haven't seen everything. So, um, hopefully a lot of this will be new, and, yeah. And I just realized I did not have my headphones on. And in fact, I am on speaker. Well, I'll be right back and fix it. And guys, we are back. And that was really awkward, because I was watching something else and then I had to use the speaker. But anyways, here we go. Insert. Analyzing item. Please stand back. Is it gonna do anything, or...? Oh, there we go. Introductory wool. Ready. Okay, good. Now you understand how to build a monument. Okay, let's go. Now, okay, for diver... So, okay, wait, hold on. Um, when you successfully finish a portion of the monument, you close off the corresponding branch. There are 10 more to go. Go get them. Anyways, yeah, there we go. So, yeah, um, before I go any farther, let me just explain what diversity is, sort of is. Diversity is a CTM map that is sort of, it's different from its other variants of people where you go to different sections with spawners and hostile mobs and then you try to get the wool. It's different. You have to do different challenges and different things like let's say the puzzle branch and the dropper branch. If you know what the dropper map is, you technically just drop and try to avoid obstacles on the way down and things like that. And there's the escape branch, there's the trivia branch and all that jays. So yeah, um, so you technically have to follow, you have to complete all deep branches and then you're gonna get all the wool and this is how you complete the monument. Hence the name capture the monument or complete the monument. So yeah, so the first one we're gonna do is not arena, not parkour, cause I mean parkour is not bad, but that's not really fun. There's labyrinth, survival, boss. I'm, that always has to be the end. It's gonna be the finale. Anyways, um. I think I'm gonna go for the trivia branch because you know I want to test my knowledge on Minecraft. Anyways, anyways, so you've chosen the trivia branch. Excellent. Here's how it works: the center pressure plate presents you with a question. The possible answers will be listed around the room. You simply step on the pressure plate of the answer you believe is correct. If you're right, you move on. If you're wrong, death. Death. But okay, yeah. If at any time you want to quit, there is a button block directly centered on the ceiling that will bring you back to the hub. Yes. Uh, for every 10 questions gained, you are issued a checkpoint. If you complete all the questions correctly, the line wool will be yours. However, if you get a question wrong, you will have to restart from the checkpoint. Simple enough? Yeah. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. Let's go. Yes, I understand. Oh, 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 okay. I don't get it. Questions kill me now. <laughs> and then, yes, I understand. All right. Okay, let's start with an easy one. What game are you playing? Raftcraft? No. <laughs> Minecraft? Warcraft? Starcraft? It's totally Starcraft. No, not really. Or Warcraft. No, it's Minecraft. Now, funny thing is, um, when I first heard of Minecraft, I thought it was like, it's like some kind of like game similar to Starcraft or Warcraft. So I'm just like, yeah, I don't really want to play it. But then, you know, after being introduced by a lot of my friends, I sort of came into this and there we go. So, yeah. Um, wait, what was the question again? Um, pretty easy, let's get serious. What year was Minecraft initially released? Not, ooh, this is, uh, I, I totally forgot. I know it's not 2011 or 2012. It's either 2009 or 2010. I'm gonna go for 2009. Yeah, who created Minecraft? 
not Jens, he, not Jeb, or that, not Dinnerbone. There's Notch, which is obviously it, but let's see, nope. Anyway, let's go. Notch, Marcus. The name of the accent block in this room is Endstone. What, uh, what biome is it naturally found in? Let's see, the End, Enderland, Sky, Black. This is a trick question, because I know for a fact that the End biome is not the end. It is actually called the sky biome. The reason why it's called the sky biome is because initially there was a hint that there might be a sky dimension in Minecraft where which will which you would be able to enter that dimension by sleeping and there will be a random chance of you entering that dimension. However, that was never implemented, but the biome name stayed. So which is why you have sky even though it's the end. So it's the sky. What is the name of the accent block in this room? Decorative stone? I don't think so. Chiseled? I, it's chiseled. Something with chisel, not circle. Chisel stone brick. Chisel stone bricks. Uh, 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 uh. Is it plural or not? And here comes my sister. Take it away, Michelle. What do you think it is? Just read it carefully. Okay, can I see the other one? It's plural and not in singular. Which one do you think wait, it is, wait, my wait, dear wait, sister? Wait, I can't see. It's chiseled stone brick and chiseled stone bricks. What else is there to say? Plural, singular. Are all other items? I don't remember. No one remembers things like that. I'm yellow. Nope, I'm dead. Goodbye, cruel world. Alright, where was I? Okay, so... Okay, I died. So, are you ready to continue? The answer is yes, yes, I know that. Let's start. What game are you playing right now? Minecraft. And easy. What year was it? Minecraft initially released? 2009. Who created Minecraft? Marcus. And after that is which accent was found in Sky? What is found the accent block of this room? Chiseled stone bricks, apparently. Which of these items requires the least amount of wood? when crafting okay let's see um okay so for fences you're gonna need how much wood it requires do they mean logs or wood like wood a slab a slab takes a piece of log which is three a fence takes six sticks which would be one and a half no two and a half three it would take three sticks to get fences but wait, for one fence, it would be 1.5. Yeah, so that would be 1.5. A slab would be a half. A ladder would, oh gosh, the math here, the math! Let's see, six sticks, six, you get two from six planks, and therefore you would get three for each trapdoor. Um, ladders, uh, you have seven sticks, seven sticks, four, that is two, eight. So that would be eight sticks. So from eight, you take seven. It's like minuscule. Eh? Nope. 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 No. <laughs> oh God, I don't understand the question. I have no clue. <laughs> All right, let's just get back to the spot where we were at. Let's see, the, 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 the notch. The sky. Chisel stone bricks. All right, let's see. So we know it's not ladders. Requires the least amount of wood when crafting. So I probably meant like how much it takes for wood. So that takes three. That takes six. So six sticks, that would be Three and a half. One, two, that'll take four. Trapdoor takes six, four, three. Slab. Yeah, we got it. Okay, in a standard game of Minecraft, what do you not do in the nether? Grow a tree? No, you can do that. You can't sleep. Find overworld mobs. This has changed. You can find skeletons. Place water. No. Wait, which one? What can you not do in the nether? You can find overworld mobs. You can't sleep. 
you can place water actually you, you just can't use a water bucket to place water you can still place water and you can grow a tree so sleep sponges no longer have much water but it does share the placing and blaking sound of which block i think it's leaves or grass it's not wool it's not soul sand it's not dirt it's grass yep this room is built mostly with full with full blocks of what else and what else half slabs half blocks slabs double half slabs nope nope ow 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 Ow. Hmm. Okay, I am back and I don't believe it is wool. I can't punch it, I can't test it. Uh, okay. I know it's not soul sand for once. Huh. Dirt. Let's go! Nope. Nope. That did not work out. Uh, what is it then? I mean, I know it's not wool. Is it... Huh. Is it wool? No, it can't be wool. I remember it wasn't wool. I totally forgot that was the chamber that I totally got right. It was this one that I got wrong. Let's see, so it's not double half slabs. Half sl half blocks? No, they're not half blocks. No way, half slabs. Nope! 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 Nope. Yeah. Be right back, guys. And we are back. Let's see. Half blocks. Half slabs. Not these. And it's not those. And it can't be that. That just sounds wrong. Slabs. <sighs> well, trick questions. They're fun. How many blocks of clay is used to convert to a brick slab? How many blocks of clay is used to convert? So it didn't say crafting. So therefore, my logic before would be correct in this room. So let's see, for a brick slab. Let's see, for a brick slab, you need one, two, three. You need three blocks of, I mean, three brick blocks. In order to do that, you would need 12. So technically, to make a brick slab for one slab. So three divided by that, it would nine, 12. What? How many blocks of clay is used to convert? I am so, whatever. There we go. <laughs> Never mind. it was the crafting thing again. Trick questions! I have no clue what's going on. I think I'm just overthinking everything. Obsidian is known to be the high blast resistant. Which of these has even more? Not jukebox and porter block. Anvil, snow, and portal block. Hoop. Which of these methods would generate cobblestone? Placing water above flowing lava, that would do, but just in case placing lava over flowing water, that would create smooth stone. Um, placing water above lava source, obsidian. Placing lava above water source, that would, yeah, so it's this one. All biomes have an ID number used to things like super, super flat land. What is the biome number for two? I think it was two. I think it was two. I could be wrong. Oh, no, yeah, it's right. Prior to 1.7, birch trees were the rarest tree in Minecraft. They were? Oh, okay. I'll, I'll take it. They were only naturally generated in which biome? It's not taiga. Forest. I think it's forest. Not plains and not river, so it's definitely forest. Doop. Soul sand is used to grow nether wart. Which of these potions does not require nether wart? Potion of slowness. You need that. Potion of weakness. I believe it's weakness, but just in case. Potion of harming. No. Potion of invisibility. Weakness. <laughs> yeah. Okay. How many layers of fallen snow does it take to equal the height of one block of snow? Uh, is this a trick question? Is this a trick question? I have no clue. Because, I mean, if you do eight, that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But then... Uh, how many layers does it take to height of one? Okay, I'm just going to go eight. Oh, yeah, you're right. Beside coal, certain wooden items can be used when smelting. Which of these cannot be used as full? You can use a trapdoor. You can use a sign, maybe? A fence gate? You can use a fence gate's chest. I'm going to try sign! Yes! Which statement is false about bedrock? Bedrock cannot be pushed or pulled by pistons. That is true. Bedrock can only be obtained in creative mode. That is also true. 
unless you're using mods. Bedrock is naturally generated in the end. Yes, the portal at the end is naturally generated by when to do not not cannot wait no. What do you mean natural? Do you mean like naturally natural like end stone or do you mean like after you kill the ender dragon and increase the portal? Wait, let's read this one first. Mobs cannot naturally spawn. That is true. So it must be this. Nope. Nope. Ow. I guess I'm wrong. Checkpoint. Okay. Anyways, let's quickly get back. Oh, I can't read the signs. Can't read the signs. Can't read the signs. Okay. I, I still got it right. What is... Oh. Oh, I can't read the signs. Oh, gosh. Can't read the song. Jukebox. End portal frame. Okay. This is... This is... Oh gosh, I don't, I can't see things. Water over lava. No, la not lava source. Um, water level, the, 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 the water overflowing lava. Oop. ID number two. Nope, nope. That's ID number six. And planes forced. Forced. And potion of weakness. <laughs> All right, there we go. Um, how much layer is eight? I, it wasn't a sign. I know it's not a trap door. I'm gonna go trap door. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, I'm, I'm wrong. I'll be right back, guys.